So I'd like to take this opportunity to thank each and every one of you who had a part in making all of this happen. All of you who had faith in me, who knew I could do it, and uh, who stood behind me through the whole thing. I owe you everything. So thank you very much, and I hope I live up to all of your expectations. <laughs> all right. All right. Any questions for Ginny? Uh, I, don't, uh, I don't have a question, but I would like to clear something up, if you don't mind. Uh, sure. In case anybody noticed the, uh, the stain on front of Miss Blake's dress oh. and wondered whether or not she could hold her liquor, well, you can uh, blame me. I, apparently I can't hold my own. I tripped up my own two feet and spilled a glass of red wine on her. But she's too much of a pro to let it bother her. I just didn't want anybody to get the wrong idea, that's all. Thank you, Thank you Mr. Shelton. Just for the record, I was planning on dyeing the dress red anyway. You don't have to hold up your hand. This isn't the schoolroom. I was wondering what Ginny planned to do for her first story on the new show. Ah, well, I'm afraid I can't give away trade secrets, but I can promise you one thing. It will be a blockbuster. Okay. It better be. We need the ratings. <laughs> <laughs> yes? What about your old friends from Teen Time? You'll still do stuff about kids, right? Absolutely. I plan on dealing with material that touches all of us. Thank you. Hit the crime angle hard. I mean, maybe if you can draw enough attention to the subject, the police will help us out with it. Really? Yeah. You're absolutely right. That's yeah. very good. Thank Any more questions? questions? We'll take two more. There's All I have to do is hire more cops. Uh, well, I think that is an Thank answer. You. How about another question? <laughs> All right. All right. Else? Anyone else? Derek, why don't you take over for a minute? All right. Uh, how about Frisco Jones? A few questions. Scobia. Frisco. Okay. Let's hear it. How are you, Bobby? You and Terry get home all right? Good. What was bugging Brock anyway? You what? Thanks for that. Fire me. Are you all right? There's no chance of that. No, we'll be a lot of our conscience. Just listen, Julie. I shall bring a doctor over for you and Terry. In the meantime, you sit tight, you touch nothing. I'll be right there. <laughs> Alan, I'm going to need your help. What's up? All right. Got a corpse on Thank you very much. All right. Good. 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 A career that's going like a skyrocket. You're admired. You're respected by everybody, not just your friends, but your co You got any uh, regrets? No. Just that uh, I might lose it all. No way that's going to happen unless you just throw it away. <laughs> okay, back to work. Well, listen, I'm sorry to drag you out of here. It's all right. I'll do anything I can. Come on, let's go. <laughs> There's no chance of that. No, we'll be, uh... He's got a good reason, unfortunately. What's wrong? Listen, um... Colbert Ramsey had him send a homicide crew over to Brock's penthouse. Homicide? Brock's penthouse? What happened? Brock's dead. What? He's been shot. Where's Bobby? She's at the penthouse. Is she all right? Yeah, well, she called me on the phone. I don't know how Brock wound up dead. Yeah, well, she, uh, she sounded pretty shaken. Uh, Tom and I are heading over there right away. I want to go with you. Yeah, I was about to suggest that she's going to make you help. Anything I could do? Yeah. You better tell Holly what happened. Um, she's also going to need a little time. I'm going to be tied up for quite a while. Of course. But don't tell everyone just yet. <laughs> right? Let them know. Uh, have a good time with you. Opportunities to deal with this. I'm ready. 